morning friends and welcome back to another day on the vlog okay so you guys two things one i'm trying something different out with my hair okay so if you see something that looks a little bit out of place don't say nothing you're looking too hard all right so shout out to aliki a friend she helped me yesterday like shape it and cut it and like i'm just experimenting so i don't know but secondly your girl is back in mexico city after a couple weeks of traveling it's been really a really good time but i'm excited to be back and so i am just hoping to have a really sweet and perfect day today saturday and first up on the list i'm going to meet the girlies maria and Yunuen, who you guys know if you've watched the mexico city vlogs but i'm about to head over to our first stop of the day which is a nail shop we're gonna get our nails done. I'm going to the same place that I got these done. And I'm gonna try to do like a fun summer color today. So I'm really excited to take you guys along. We're gonna be hitting some of the spots that is like, if you haven't been to these spots while you've been in Mexico City, I don't know what you're doing, okay? So I'm really excited. It's gonna be a really good day. Can't wait to take you guys along. So the first stop of the day is Calma Nail Bar and this place is still fairly new so it's really clean and sleek inside. The customer service is amazing. They're always offering drinks, wanting to make sure you're comfy. The girlies arrived late as per usual, and so we only had time for simple gel manicures. I ended up going with this red color which I feel like is really perfect for fall and overall we were really happy with the results. After that, we went over to Jenny's Quesadillas, which is actually Elenita's Quesadillas. I'm not too sure what happened to Jenny, but it seems like the setup is the same, the offerings are the same. So this is a place you really have to check out when you come to Mexico City. The line is always super long, but it's well worth it. All right, y'all, after about an hour of waiting, I'm just kidding, it was just 30 minutes. 30 minutes. <laughs> we got our tlacoyos from Jenny's Quesadillas, but it's actually not Jenny anymore. Her name is Elenita. Elenita. Si, Elenita. But it still looks the same, it still looks really good. Maria, she always gets tlacoyo. What, what's your order, Maria? <laughs> My order duo is dos tlacoyos con frijol y chicharrón guisado. Con queso. Con queso y quesillo. Y quesillo. Mm -hmm. y... Without nopales. Sin nopales. Sin nopales. And my order is dos tlacoyos con frijol y mole verde con queso. And it's so buzzed down. We gotta do a taste test. Mm hmm. Mm. That's what I'm talking about. That might even be better than Jenny. No way. Mm hmm. Yeah, even better. Mm hmm. Mm-hmm. That's delicious. You know when you have to try. Mm-hmm. Necesitas probar. El queso se ve bueno. Sí. Tiene textura, tiene color, se ve que tiene sabor. <laughs> Flavor. Okay. You can, you can tell we have been watching a, a good video. Oh, okay, okay. Wow, look at that cheese pool. It doesn't get better than that. Wow. El queso. El queso. It's the point. Yeah. The queso makes everything, but I feel like the mole verde is really like what makes it so good. Me gusta el sazón. Yeah. Sazón. sazón? Like the seasoning? The flavor. The yeah. flavor. The, okay. Mm -hmm. It's so good, you guys. Next time you're in Mexico City, come to the corner. It's right outside of Tierra Garat. We always come here, get a little drink, and then eat our tacoyos. So don't miss out, okay? Next time you come to Mexico City, if you are a photographer, <laughs> if you are a fashion designer, uh -huh. um, if you are a um, producer, if you are, <laughs> I don't know, next time you come to Mexico City. And if you are one of those, you can reach me out. <laughs> you know, I'm an actress, I'm a dancer, I'm a model. Uh -huh. um, She's a triple threat. Mm -hmm. Can you sing? Uh, no, but, but I will. <laughs> <laughs> if you want me to, I will. <laughs> eh, si. Sí. Okay. Excelente. See you next time. Bye. I'm just kidding. Okay, we're gonna eat our tlacoyos <laughs> and then we're gonna go to our next stop of the day, which you guys already know what is going on. Okay, but I'll keep you updated. <laughs> Can you 
aquí ya ya me quité las uñas ya me las arreglan este y ahorita venimos a comernos unos platos me compré me compré se me Hola, lo siento. Okay. Um, ¿Me puedes dar un café chico? Claro. De um, tres leches. Claro que sí. sí. Um, dos. Pero, 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 ¿puedes cobrar por separado? Claro que sí. ¿Algo más que decir? No, es todo. Gracias. Sí. All right, you guys, so I discovered something at Tierra Garat, and it's a Tres Leches Frappe. Y'all, when I tell you, this is so good. Um, I just get the small size with the regular milk. So good, like a perfect, a perfect treat. So we're really treating ourselves today. We're really going all in, because that's what you do when you're trying to have the perfect day. You know what I'm saying? So taste test. See? Mm. Is that what you got? It's a little different from last time I got it, but it's still really Maybe good. Maybe it's the coffee. Maybe it's the coffee. Maybe I said without coffee yeah. last time. Mm. But this is so good. Like, when you come here, you go to Elenita's Quesadillas or Jenny's, whichever one is here. Come to Tierra Garat, get you a Tres Leches Frappe, and just be on your way. Have a good day, okay? <laughs> All right, we're gonna make a quick stop at this bazaar. So we are currently on Calle Colima, which is Colima Street. And all along the street, they have different bazaars, different boutique shops, art um, galleries, really cute street. This is also the, the street that Rosetta Panadaria is on. And that's where we're going after this because we have to get a pastry. But especially if you come here on the weekends, they're gonna have a lot of bazaars, a lot of open street markets um, that you can just come and peruse. So we're just gonna pop in here really quick and see what's going on. to watch where you walk okay because the sidewalks are actually really uneven and you can think that you're doing okay and the next thing you know you're falling on your face so you always gotta like glance down every three to five seconds but now the bazaar was super cute we're going to our next stop rosetta to get some bread some pan before we go to chapultepec and have a picnic i'm so excited from Panaderia Rosetta so if you guys have looked up like where to eat in Mexico City I'm sure you have seen this bakery and you would think with everybody recommending it it's overrated but it's actually not like it's really good and you almost get mad that it's as good as they say it is you know but anyways we got the goods and now we're heading to Chapultepec we're gonna have a beautiful picnic out in the park just relaxing you know it's what the out. girls need. It's what the girls need. The sun is out. The sun is out. We're hoping it doesn't start raining anytime soon, but it's such a good day. I'm having like a 10 out of 10 day so far. <laughs> Thank you. 
Chapultepec and I feel like I have shown you guys this part of the park in past videos but it's just so much calmer than the main areas where there are a lot of vendors and so right now I'm trying to find the spot <laughs> that has um, the most greenery so we can set up a beautiful picnic hopefully it's, it's as beautiful as I remember <laughs> I'll keep you updated in the machine. At the gym. Machine, see. Yeah. Machine. What? <laughs> got situated with the girlies they love the spot love but it. now it's time to eat oh my god so many bugs hold on hold on to eat the bread that we got from rosetta panaderia okay so i got three for us so that we can try them all actually i think i have had it i have had it in los angeles so we got the cinnamon roll but i forgot because i didn't know what it looked like los angeles is not mexico Sí, pero casi. What do you mean, casi? <laughs> LA to Mexico, casi. <laughs> sí, Please, Maria. No it's literally. Sí. Okay, no. you guys, look at what we have here. We got the guayaba roll, the almond roll, cinnamon roll, and then this is a uh, oreja, and it's like it's native to Mexico or what? Yeah. Sí. Sí. Ah, sí. Okay. Of all the country, very native to Mexico. So we're gonna try these right now with the girlies. <laughs> That's crazy. I've never, I've never heard that word in my life. <laughs> anyway, independientemente. guys what a day it has been such a beautiful day at Chaputapec it's been amazing like 10 out of 10 recommend but we just had a beautiful picnic these girls amazing and then Maria wanted me to braid her hair so I did a little some some <laughs> but we noticed that the sky is getting really gray and so we got to pack up before it starts raining on us so she's gonna have to go like this but Everybody's packing up now. That's crazy. Okay, but we're gonna, but it's been a beautiful day. Um, I will keep you guys updated on what we end up doing later. But 10 out of 10, highly recommend. <laughs> Gotta keep the wig safe. Ok, 
Good night, everybody. <laughs> Independientemente. <laughs> Independientemente. Independientemente. Exactamente. Exactamente, independientemente.